Oh. You guys up there, okay, jogging on the spot. Let's put this up a little bit. All right. Let's go. Put the timer on. Okay, good. Okay, job on Try and get your arms going as well with this. Okay. Good. Very light side to side action. Okay. Keep going, guys. Good. Okay. Touch your heels. Okay. Okay, knee up. Okay, star jumps. Okay, good. Okay. Pop the punch. Okay, your arm comes round, you want to hook it round, guys, okay? Finish about that position. Okay? Great. All okay, yeah, everything going well, we're working. Good. When you do this, try and bring your hip around as well. Good. Now, change that to uppercut. Uppercut. Good. Keep going on that one. Brilliant. So, just get in the hand. Try and make, you, make sure your fist is tight at the end of the punch. Because if you were to hit something, you'd want it to be nice and strong. Good. Now, keep going. Okay. Now, elbows coming around. Strike. Turn your shoulders around here. Good. Brilliant. As you come around, bring the opposite hand to your hip. Okay? Good. Good. I want you to stop moving now and just punch to the front. Just your arms. Notice how I bring my hands and my hip. Okay? Good. Brilliant, keep going. We're gonna go on to blocks now. Some of these blocks you might find difficult. Don't worry about it, guys. Just aim to go upwards. What you're doing is crossing your arm in front of the one coming down. Okay, that one coming down inside. The blocking arm is in front. Okay? Great, so. The main thing is getting the arm up, getting some exercise, mobilizing those joints, and later on you'll learn the correct techniques. Okay? Brilliant. Now, I want you to change that block. We're going behind our cells block. This is called a forearm block. Okay? Brilliant. What are you doing? You just want to keep your heart rate at a nice steady level. Nice movement. Four arm block. Okay, I'll slow it down again. Now we're going to go inside. Watch. Inside block. Not 
जल्दबियां लॉकडाउन लॉकडाउन तो दिस इज़ इनसाइड क्लॉक बट डोंट वरी टू मच अगेन अबाउट द एक्शन नाउ द नेक्स्ट व्हाट वी गोइंग टू डू इज़ डाउनवर्ड ब्लॉक यू कैन स्टे ऑन द स्पॉट फॉर दिस वन वन आर्म हियर स्लाइड डाउन ब्रिंग द हैंड बैक टू हिम नाउ Those of you that are quite fit, I want you to switch in your legs. Switch your legs side to side. Okay. For those of you that know this, otherwise, just downward block, very light. Okay. And then we're going to go on to kicks then. Okay. Brilliant. Okay. Good. Okay. Jog on the spot, everyone. Get your arms going. Brilliant. Right, we're going to go on to kicks now. In between all the kicks, we're going to have a, a little jog. Okay, this is called a front kick. Kick, put it down. Just this action here. Kick, bring it back, put it down. Put it down. Okay. That's all. Okay, so that's what I want you to do. Now we're going to keep doing that, warming those legs up, getting the hips nice and mobile. Now, also working on the muscles that require you to kick. Okay, so keep doing that. Feel those muscles work. You don't have to kick very high; just keep it lower if you want. Keep it at a lower level if you want. Okay. Good. If you do karate, you will kick mid level. Good, keep it going. Nearly there. You're gonna feel your legs working now. Good. Okay, relax up. Jog on the spot. How are you doing? Hopefully, you're doing all right. I can see some things are quite tricky for you. Good. Okay, next. Next one is going to be the knee kick. Okay, this is quite common in the fitness club. I want you to calf raise and bring your knee in between the other legs. Calf raise and bring this knee up. Calf raise, knee up. Watch. I'll show you the feet now. Okay. Calf raise down. So if you look at the feet when I just before I. Knee lift, arms up, calf raise, bring the left leg, calf raise, right leg, calf raise, left leg, calf raise, right leg, and keep that action going for a bit longer. Okay. Now some of you might go a little bit faster. Okay. Keep it going. Okay, few more. Okay, next one. Next one we're moving on to is the crescent kick. This is very quite straightforward for beginners. Your knee comes at an outward angle, and then it turns in, and your foot is in that position. If you look at the foot, it's in that position. Okay, that position is coming around like a block. Okay, crescent kick. Crescent kick. Okay. Good. Keep it going. Keep getting that leg. Now you're working it. Last one. Now last of the kicks. This one. Okay. We're going to finish with a jog on the spot. Working both legs. This is good for use as a block or even a strike. Okay. Good. Okay, jogging. Get your arms involved in the jog as well. Okay, so far. Okay, everyone. Yeah. Good. So that's the kicks. We're going to go into some exercises now. Okay. The first one's going to be a squat. Make sure the squat is nice, deep squat. Okay. 
and keep it going. Right. So, so arms in front, drop into your heels and up, into your heels and up, okay? Into your heels and up. Okay, keep going, I'll show you the lower part. Okay, so we're in a nice deep stance. Good. All right, guys. Back straight. Okay, a few more. Three more. Okay, relax. Okay, jogging on the spot or have a rest? It's your choice. Jog on the spot or have a rest right now. Okay? Next one. Okay, reverse lunge, okay? So, those of you that are jogging on the spot, welcome. Beginners, don't feel like you have to keep moving. Okay, next one is just drop back lunge. Reverse lunge. Okay, reverse lunge. Hands like a fighter's. Okay, I'm going to do around 10 of those, dropping back lunge. Okay, hold that position. Try and keep your body straight and still. Try not to wobble side to side when you're doing this. Okay, two more, one more, and back. Good, jog on the spot or rest. Jog on the spot or rest, guys. Okay, the next one will be simple side leg lift, okay? So, one leg up and down, and then the other leg up and down, sideways, okay? Good, brilliant. Hills, the hills, I hope you're doing well. Look after Mum and Dan, Oliver and Carl, they're new to this. By the way. Okay, and two more after this, one with each leg. One more. Good. Rest or jog. Now the last one of the exercises will be. We're going to the floor for this one, guys, so I apologise if you haven't got the room, but do your best. Again, if you can't get to the floor, just do something easy like a light star jump. Otherwise, we're just going to do a bridge up. Now, those of you that can, at the top of the bridge, lift one leg up and back and down. Go. And down. Okay, good. Two more. One more of these. Good. Okay, guys. Good. Right, have a rest. Have a quick drink. We're moving on towards the... We're going to do the moves now. Quick drink. Very quick. And then we're moving into the karate moves before we stretch down the finish, guys. Okay, well done. So the karate moves you're going to do, if you watch carefully while you're drinking, will be from this stance, step forward, punch. So if you look at my stance, I step forward in that kind of stance. Back leg straight, front leg bent. Step forward, punch. Step forward, punch. Okay, guys, step forward, alternating legs. So when you're ready, let's go. Good. Now try and get into a deep stance. Okay, a deep stance. <coughs> not so deep if you're not too sure, just go up to about that. Okay, the punch happens with the hand, the leg that's stepping. Okay, so your leg is stepping, you punch it. Now we're going to do four more techniques the same way. But a different technique, okay? Keep going. Two 
two more. Um, okay, two and back. Okay, good. Rest or jog on the spot. Okay, next one is rising block. So now we're going to step forward. Rising block. Let's go up. So the same stance, but rising block as you step, okay? Rising block. Now when you step, I want you to point with the opposite hand. Step. Point with the opposite arm. So I'm stepping right leg, left arm is pointing, rising block. Okay? That's quite hard. Don't worry too much about the point. If you're new, just step in and block. Just step in and block. Okay, rise in block. Good. Okay, next one is downward block. Downward block. Is that right? Yeah. Downward block. Step with your right block with your right. Okay. Good. This is downward block. And again, this is an easy level, guys, so you might not fit, you might not feel it if you do karate fit usually, but that's the point, okay? It's easy, quick, and wakes you up for the evening, gets you a good night rest later on, okay? Just by activating yourself for 20 minutes, as well as learning a bit of karate. One more. Now, you can go a bit faster if you're quite advanced, okay? For those of you quite advanced. Okay. Okay, where are we? Okay, we've got one more on this, and then we're down into the warm down section. Step into front stance. Bring your foot back, front kick, step into front stance. Foot back, kick, step into front stance. Okay, I'll show you sideways. Kick, step. Other leg. Kick, step. Go back, kick, step. Okay? Knee there, knee there. And one more now after this. And great job on the spot. Okay, guys, well done. We're nearly there. Three minutes and we're finished. We're going to warm down. So now we're going to warm down, very quick, basic stretch. Shake loose, shoulder roll. Okay, shoulder roll opposite way. Now get the arms big, open up your chest, feel the stretch on the front part. Okay, now turn your arms nice and big backwards. Okay, good. Stretch over to your right. Feel that stretch. And chin, switch over. Now, I want you to go into what we call a sumo stance. I'm going to take this to the floor now. There's some stretches we're going to go on the floor. So feet outwards, sumo stance stretch. You drop in, push out here with your elbows. It's like you're relaxing on your thighs, but at the same time you're stretching. All right, I want you to slowly, now if you can't drop fully, go to the side and stretch this way. Otherwise, drop fully and push this knee out. Now switch over, stretch this way, unless you can drop fully. If you can, be very careful, listen to your body, Drop, okay, now, change. Now I want you to turn and face this way and stretch in your hip flexor. Feel a stretch on the hip flexor, nice and big. You can extend your arm if you want. 
chin to the side. Nice and big stretch. Feel this part stretching. If you need to hand there and hold yourself there a little bit, support, do that. Great. Now, very slowly onto the floor. Legs wide. Nice stretch forward. Well done. Stretch forward. To your left, very gently. And again, try and keep your back straight. You don't have to reach your toes. The main thing is getting a stretch. You can hold it here. This way, no into the knee. And change other side. Okay. Getting forward. Good. Same here. From here, stretch. Okay. You don't have to just go as far forward. Don't hunch your shoulders. Don't arch your back. Try and keep your whole back straight. Good. Hold it there. Good. Bring your legs in. A few more stretches and we're finished, guys. The legs straight again. Back of your legs stretching. Not, not bending your legs. Not the, the goal. The goal is stretching your legs. So reach only as far as you can. Back straight again. Good. Now, shake loose. And now, if you can do it again, one leg, left leg over right. This is the easy version. Just bring this, try and pull this leg slightly, stretch here and twist your body, okay? If you can do the full one, go ahead. The full one would be to put your elbow here and stretch fully. And change your legs and last stretch you're gonna do now. Okay. Let's Good, okay. Once you've done that, push your knees down in this position and we're finished, guys, we're finished. So loosen up, just loosen up a little bit, okay? And gently on to your knees and stand up, guys. And shake everything loose, legs and arms. Shake legs and arms up. Okay, guys? So that's, that completes the session. Let me know if you found that nice and, you know, it's not going to be a hard session, but you are always welcome to push yourself a little harder in this time. For beginners, you guys need to listen to your body. So well done. Fantastic. Great to have some new people.